The Carpenter and Oniroku. Once upon a time, there was an extremely fast-flowing river. Since the current of the river was too fast, no matter how many times people built bridges over it, each one got destroyed and swept away every time it rained. And so, the people in the village decided to go to a town and hire a skillful carpenter to build a sturdy, unbreakable bridge. Thus, a highly skilled carpenter came to the village. Wow, I've never seen a river with such a strong current before. The carpenter was overwhelmingly surprised by the violently flowing current of the river. Then, at that moment, a single oni came out of the river. The oni was big, had two horns and a wide mouth that stretched from ear to ear with sharp fangs. Hey, you! This is my territory. What did you come here for? Oh no, please forgive me. I was just asked to build a bridge over this river. Please don't kill me. Build a bridge over this river? Well... All right, human. I'll build a bridge for you here. What? Really? But instead, I will take those two eyeballs of yours. You got it? It's a deal. After these words, the Oni went back into the river. The next day, when the carpenter went to the river, there was a huge, fine bridge there. As the surprised carpenter gaped at the bridge, the big oni again showed up in the river. Look at this, human. I built this bridge. Excellently done. As we promised, I'll take your eyeballs now. Ay! Please wait. Spare me just one more day. The carpenter got frightened and quickly ran away. The carpenter kept on running desperately, having no idea where he was actually going. And then he found himself lost deep inside the forest. When he stopped to listen to what was going on around him, from somewhere deep inside the forest, he started to hear a mysterious song. I hope Oniroku is coming back soon With human eyeballs as a gift I hope it's going to be soon That song is probably being sung by Oni children This whole area must be the living place of the Oni The carpenter started to run like crazy again when he returned to the river where the big bridge was built, that oni was still there, waiting for the carpenter's return with his head held high. Now, give me your eyeballs. I beg you, please forgive me. Have mercy on me. All right. If you don't want to give me your eyeballs that much, try to guess my name. The carpenter had no idea what the Oni's name was. Oh, oh, Onichi! No! Onichiro! Onisaburo! Onishiro! No, no, no! If you fail once again, I'll pull out your eyeballs! Then the carpenter remembered the mysterious song he had heard back in the deep forest. Yes, Oniroku! Your name is Oniroku! Right after the carpenter shouted that name, the Oni instantly vanished like a haze. And then the carpenter could return to the town safely. <laughs> <laughs>